Guys, welcome back to some classic old Malzahar gameplay in the mid lane. We're facing a Rise, so Rise will definitely start either a Mana Crystal or the tier, right? How do we counter that? How do we counter more mana against more mana? We go for the same build. So we go for a tier just because this guy is also going to go tier. That is pretty much my... I mean, if you guys watched my last video on the Echo, I said if I see someone use Corruption Potion, I do the same. Um, if I am a Corruption Potion using Champion, like an Echo, he is very good with Corruption Potion, so why not go for it? Same thing here, he goes for tier, we could also go for tier, we don't need to upgrade it. Rise is very good with the tier upgraded, but we don't have to upgrade it, we just gonna benefit from the extra mana. Oh. Don't miss that. Don't miss that, buddy. Anyways, I am going... Um, Kind of going all the old classic Malzar guys. We're going for Airy, Mana Flow, Transcendence. Could have gone Scorch, but Gathering Storm is my... I prefer that a little bit more. Magic of Footwear, Biscuits Delivery. Again, I I really like the Q-Max, but I'm going to go for the E-Max this game. Just because I want to go a little bit more aggro. Maybe get some E-Bounces on the rise. Uh, especially with the more mana build. We're going for like tier into mana uh, Law Chapter. Which will give us a lot of mana in the uh, laning phase. Um... Yeah, let's just see how this one goes. I mean, again, this guy is go has a pirate rise skin. It's kind of a bug skin, so he can't play the game properly. Kidding. But it actually is bugged. It's a little bit more clunky skin. Very awkward. Like, the, the minions are just cracked, man. They are smoking something. I like we needed to waste some mana there, but it's, it's fine, it's fine, it's fine. Trundle is very annoying. He can always E and break our shield. That should not be legal. I mean, it's not a damage dealing spell, but somehow it breaks our shield. Okay, let's be careful. He's trying to get this shoved in. Not really sure why. I missed that. Damn. The all folks one. Not really sure why he's Eing the minions here. Oh, nice. So far, so good. I'm not gonna lie. Like, this is perfect for us. It's good for the Rise, too. I'm not gonna lie. Like, Rise scaling is intense uh, for the late game. But we can't really stop him, right? She went for Corruption Potion, by the way. That is uh, a little bit awkward. Don't expect that. I mean, Rise can go both, for sure. Again, he can't crack our uh, shield with his E, because it's not the damaging spell. Which is weird, if you think about it. Like, why is Trundle... <laughs> why is Trundle E breaking our shield when it's not enough damage spelling? But the Rise E doesn't. What? The minions just randomly pathed up there. Gonna miss that. We're gonna get this. Some shoes. Again, do you guys see why I want to go to Q Max against Rise? Every time I spawn my Voidlings, he's insta EQs them, which gives us a hard time to push in. But now he has no mana. We don't have mana as well, but we do have biscuits. I have to stop him here. I need to have the prio on the back here. Bruh. Really? Bruh. I missed four out of... Uh, all, I literally missed all the minions there. Very, very awkward. He can't freeze. I mean, it's a not a good choice because I have the first back. I can just in and push in and force him to stay. This guy has... I'm not sure what he's trying to do. Nice. Pretty good, buddy. Okay. 
I don't I don't like this. He's gonna TP in. I have a good back here. Uh hopefully Toronto doesn't go. Because if he doesn't go, Rise doesn't go. Oh that's okay. It works, it works. It's bad. Bug. Uh Rise kinda trolled that. I'm not gonna lie. I, I have no comments on that. He kinda entered. He should have taken this wave and reset it instant repeat back. Instead, he tried to like greed for another wave. Uh, I'm not sure if my E would have killed him there, so I, you know, took the uh didn't want to take the risk, so I flashed and basic attacked, since I knew that was gonna be enough. Very awkward minions. I'm going Q Max, man. This is just awkward. I can't really push in the wave. I'm losing the trades against a corruption potion, zero item rise. It's because it's like insta clearing my uh, void links every time. And E def depends on the void links. I'm just gonna go one point, one point. I don't think I should spawn void links even. He kills me with a basic? That's okay. They can't troll him that. It's fine. Nice. Uh, push next wave. <clears throat> Good job. Now make him miss that. I got both kills. I'm happy. And he's gonna... Uh, he's gonna lose most of this. Faster, 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 please. Spam, 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 spam. Nice. Good, 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 good. Sure. I'll take that. I'm happy with that. To be fair. Um, yeah, I'm gonna go two points in Q next and then E, Q, E, Q. Um, again, you guys notice how hard it is to like push in the wave. Uh, he had, he doesn't, didn't have this. He used to have a uh, amplifying tome, but he still out push because I never had void links. If I had Q max, I can use uh, E once and then he's reset with my Q, right? Instead of having to worry about spamming or sp yeah, perma spamming void links. That's good. Mm. That was a very good word, buddy. Now he's out of lane here, so we can just spawn the woodlings. And now we try to zone him off. No mind. No way I'm dead here. Come on. What is that intel? Bro, he outrode me from here to here. It's okay, it's okay. Worth, 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 worth. Again, I'm not sure why they're focusing mid so hard, man. This guy is not winning his lane, yet they're like heavy focusing two versus twos. I'm happy Kha'Zix was there, I'm not gonna lie. I didn't have any vision of that. Bleh. Huh? <laughs> okay. I didn't have any vision of that play, to be fair. We have no vision here, which is bad. Oh, no. It's fine. Close, close, close. Respectable. That's bad, though. Topside dying. He's gonna lose a lot of plates. Um, yeah, I have a pink here, but he hugged bot side. Very, very unlucky timing. Oh, why, man?
Really? That didn't die? Alright, voice crank. I'm not sure why you're... Alright. Tunnel might be topside. Yeah, these guys are kind of trolling, not gonna lie. Not sure if they're doing, but could be. This is very, very awkward how they play. Kind of too obvious. Land that blissy. Close. Not bad, not bad. Let's go Sork Shoes here. Um, like, yeah, we had too much vision here. Kha'Zix literally invaded topside. There was nowhere else for Toronto to be but here, right? Or in base. But, like, yeah, they used forcing mids. Um, we're getting fed. Kha'Zix is getting fed. Very, very good. We got the first hit turret as well. Awesome. Let's just, yeah, let's just take this. We can save that. But now we can defend this, right? How about? We could dive top here. If Kha'Zix come, this is a kill. He's not that strong, right? There's no way he one-shots all of us. I think this is good he's gonna R away here nice let's push this wave in get the turrets get the plates mm, I also don't want to give um, too much to rise here That's fine. He's probably on his way though. Hmm, this is a little bit risky. Cause I don't have anything up here. <laughs> Alright. <laughs> Let's Uh, this is our cue to back. Kha'Zix went for Ez. That's not ideal. It's okay. We should always pay attention to the map, guys. Even though we pinged, we did, like he didn't come. There is no need for to force it. Most people would probably keep chasing, die, and be like, Well, he pinged on his way, right? We have to pay attention to the what's, what the scenario is. 
Trundle is hugging Rise again. I mean, I'm not sure why this guy is getting so much shadowing. Uh, probably his boyfriend, I think. I don't know. No flame, though. Um, they have, like, a lot of uh, tanks, right? This guy's gonna get... Ooh. But this guy's gonna get tanked. I might go demonic second or third. No, 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 no. I'm going Rabba. Rabba does is good. Into voids. Rice TP's in for the Herald. Probably. I can't go solo check that. I'm just gonna catch this and then rotate. I guess you like that. An ally has been slain. That's not good, guys. Hello? Is my Mundo okay or? He was about to bail on that fight. <laughs> what? Uh, I've seen it all. <laughs> it's okay. It's okay. Don't tell. Don't tell. He. Uh, it doesn't have TP. We might lose this rake. I mean, I could always TP in here. Scout the fight. Mundo is not moving. No scenario fighting. I don't have R. Now Mundo is moving. A little bit too late. He jumps away. Gets killed. Unlucky. That is not good at all. Their Volibear is just uber strong right now. I could probably defend this. Is anything? Let's go ball, take ball turret here. They should use reset in my opinion, nothing to take. You little stinky rat. You little weasel, you. That's fine. Let's take turret. Again, we have to play the correct macro, guys. Like, pushing mid. We can't never take this turret. It's too far. They're gonna respawn. I have no R. I have no flash. I have nothing up. Twitch is low. Everyone is low. Resetting or not resetting. Going bot here is the best play. I have full mana. Full. I don't have to reset just yet. I have a lot of gold, but it's fine. Nothing's about to happen. If something happens, I have TP. So we just go for a bot player. Take this. Now we peace out. And now we reset and look for a mid play. With our R again. Always play around your R. Always play around cooldowns. Mm, this is not good, but... Kind of waste the TP here, but depending on if we can get something. And we got a kill, but kills doesn't win games, right? But let's hope we can push this. I mean, it was kind of low, right? Yeah, 50% is pretty good. Uh, we need someone to defend this, though, I guess. I mean, Mundo's TP doesn't defend. I guess I go. I shouldn't be have to, but we can't really help if they're misplaying. Look, did you guys see the scenario? He resets here. If he keeps pushing, okay, then it's fine. But if he resets, I can't join the fight. But now he can't join the fight, I can join the fight. Who are the strongest teammates? Me and him. So this is fine. I wonder if he can die me. I don't think so, but... And now he's moving. This is gonna be awkward. He 
You can always turn on me as well, because I have no clue where this guy is pathing. Oof. What is what is my Mundo up to? He's on crack or something, man. Why is he playing so awkwardly? Why is he there? Like <laughs> uh, <laughs> he doesn't want to defend the split. I defend the split, and then he's just randomly bot side as well. We kill with Ganash. He should be dead. Nash, 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 guess. No need to force. have any anti heal i have to go for anti heal i want to go for void but i guess i go for that i guess i go morello into Ooh. maybe you can sneak in let's see nice that's a good play Awkward. I have TPL defense. Again, a lot of defending, guys. A lot of defending here. Because uh, Mundo is not. I mean, this this is... Do you guys see the classic of how Mundo plays? If you guys watch my macro guide, this guy is a reactive player. He doesn't really read the map well. He's just playing and... Um, kind of playing. I didn't even eat this guy. I'm trolling. Really? I didn't. My E didn't go off. And then it took kind of cancelled again out of vision. Okay, now he's kind of ending. We got a nib, that's good. Let's keep pushing top here. Everyone is bot sides. I don't have R, so teeping would be bad. And they're all there as well. But yeah, like this Mondo is playing reactive, right? And do you guys see the difference in CS in the level? Because this guy is not being split pushing at all. I've been split pushing, catching a lot of side waves. And it's kind of getting strong. This guy has just been running around, doing literally zero, and grouping up perma. That's why he's so weak. This is like Malzahar in uh, your guys' uh, elo, or how you guys play. And this is how like you should be playing. Always be splitting up the map and being as awkward as possible. That is just too awkward, though, for me, if I'm going to be honest. People can't read the map. Like They have too slow of like a... Um, how can I say reading of the the play like it's so obvious you're gonna reset there and just defend why are you still pushing like i don't even have to think about it or even have to look at the map i can't just tell what's gonna happen next you know catching these nice let's reset let's kill this guy and then push the bots mid is a self pushing i should be top here I think they kill him, right? Yeah. So now we have two options. The one option is going back and splitting top to make sure we uh just keep on pushing and uh, splitting. But we can also go for the option of just five manning bot because they don't have a member, right? So it's four versus five here. Um, I, I mean, I'm already here, so why not go for that play? But Twitch is already kind of misplaying by going mid here. We should be hovering bot as a five. 
or Mundo could split. Any other of those options are good, but I'm very strong. If I'm here, we don't lose a single fight. If I don't get kind of caught up or something. There should be a free turret here. That breaks my shields. Now we smith went uh, wait for mid to push and then we just keep pushing here. Slow pulling it. Hoping for e bounce. Wait, what happened to me? Huh? What? My E is not bouncing. Um guys, can we please defend this and look for a hook when they try to like force it? Clever awkward play though. Hmm. All right, I'm just gonna reset and keep it back here. He might be dead actually. Yeah, he's dead. I miss too fed, man. This is crazy how strong I am. He might be dead here too. Look. No, I swear he was gonna die to that. <laughs> Avoid laying, sir. Guys, thank you so much for watching. I hope this was enjoyable. Again, kind of like a um, kind of like an easy game. I'm not gonna lie. Like you split, you're just kind of looking at the map, playing around the map as well as possible, splitting, taking the CS on the sideway uh, side lanes, um, scaling up, getting too strong. Don't be like this Mundo. Don't use TP and just run with your team. He, I, I don't think he used TP once. Um, again, kind of like a trait in these uh, lower elos as well, where people usually have TP but no clue how to play them. I hope this was enjoyable. Uh, if you guys um, enjoyed it, please like and comment, and I'll see you guys on the next video. Peace.